Rifleman. Starring Chuck Connors. I never could make up my mind which I like better, orange or strawberry. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Packer. What do you think? What do I think about what? Orange or strawberry. Oh, well, I, I kind of like the orange. And I'll take the strawberry. Gee, thanks. <laughs> well, how do you like that? I turn my back for one minute and I find squirrels in the candy jars. Well, Millie, I'm the guilty partner. <laughs> I never could resist strawberries. There you are, two cents, paid in full. <laughs> Thank you. Mark, how about helping me with the canned goods, hmm? Sure. How are you, Neff? Hello, Lucas. Well, sir, I got problems. I'm sorry to hear that. What's wrong? That's that herd of mine. I got nearly 500 head out of my place and a sicklier looking bunch of cows you never did see. <laughs> I ain't got enough grass to feed them. Keeping my profit down, having to come in here and buy a special feed to keep them fatted up. Well, Neff, at least you have profit. <laughs> I ain't got enough land to feed my herd. But then I guess it's my own fault. <laughs> got anybody to blame but myself. Me. One of the first ranchers in North Fork. And I didn't have the sense to buy up enough good land. And Ev, Mark and I worked very hard building up that ranch. It's our home. We don't ever figure on selling it. But, well, now, did I say anything about wanting to buy your place? Oh, you didn't have to. It was written all over your face. <laughs> <laughs> written all over my face, huh? <laughs> well, that's what I get for being so easy going. <laughs> My friends all know me too well. <laughs> but then I guess it's better to have good friends and good cattle. Good seeing you, Neff. Mark, I'll put these supplies in your saddle. You take them back to the ranch. I'll be home as soon as the council meeting's over. All right, Paul. See you later, Millie. Don't forget church. There goes a fine man. Hard-working, loving father, civic-minded and a good friend. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Makes me proud just to know a man like your pa. Whew. 
sure is hot. Kid. Do I know you? <laughs> no, I don't reckon you do. Something you want? Yeah, there is. Uh, I want to ask you something. What? Y you wouldn't want to see anything happen to your dad, would you now? What are you talking about? Well, now, uh, let's just say that unless you do what I tell you, your daddy he ain't going to live very long. Mister, I got to go. Uh-uh. You ain't going nowhere, boy, except with me. No. Oh, yes. <laughs> now, I don't know how much plainer I can make it to you, boy, but what happens to your daddy from now on, that depends on you. But I just left him in town. Maybe, boy, maybe, but right now you don't know where your pa is. Now, you just ride along with me and everything will be all right. Now, come on. I can't go with you. Boy, you give me any trouble, and your daddy's going to get killed, and it'll be your fault. Now, come on. Come on. That's right, boy. This is where we're going to live for a while. Just you and me. Why won't you tell me what this is all about? Look, boy, all you've got to know is that we're going to stay here as long as necessary. Now, I ain't going to harm you. But if you try running away or something like that, then your daddy's going to get killed. Understand? Now, come on, get off that horse now. We'll have some grub. Let's do like I said. We'll put him in there. Go ahead. You didn't see him after he left your store? No, Lucas. He rode out to your ranch just like you told him to. He said he was going home, huh? Yes. And he must be someplace between here and the ranch. Maybe his horse went lame. Well, even so, Michael, why would he leave the road? I certainly didn't pass him on the way in. Oh, you know how boys are. Maybe he took a shortcut. Come on, we'll find him. I'm sure he's all right. Lucas, let me know, please. I will.
Come on out, boy. Come on. I didn't think you'd come back. I said I would, didn't I? Boy, I'm wore out. Where'd you go? Oh, I had some business. Why won't you tell me what this is about? Kid, you know all you have to know. Now, there's some blankets over here in a bedroll. It's getting kind of late. Come on, we better turn in. Go ahead. Kid, it'll be the same as pull the trigger on your old man. Now get to sleep! Didn't see it. Could be he's inside. Mark! Mark, you in there? You've been yelling yourself hoarse all night, up one gully, down the next. Yeah. Mark! Maybe this is why. Lucas, five thousand dollars for the return of your for the return of your son. Have money within twenty four hours and wait for further instruct. What is this, Mike? Is this somebody's idea of a joke? I don't think this is any joke. Somebody has Mark, and they who do this, Mike? What kind of people would? Lucas, five thousand dollars, that's impossible. Anybody who knows me knows I haven't got that kind of money, Micah. Why me? Why my boy? Why, Micah? Lucas, Lucas, boy. Come on now, calm down, take it easy. Now, we've just got to figure this thing out rationally. Come on, let's go inside. I'll make a pot of coffee. We'll talk this over. So what am I going to do? We'll figure out something. Come on, boy. That's an awful lot of money, Lucas. Can I get it, John? Well, I could make a loan on the ranch, but it wouldn't be enough. Not near enough. It isn't my money to give, Lucas. It belongs to the depositors. And I don't have enough of my own personal funds on hand to do any good. Please understand my position. Where's John? Come on. Lucas, I just heard it's not true. It can't be. It is, Neff. Well, did you give him the money? I can't, Neff. You know that. Well, it's your boy, Lucas. I can't tell you what to do. But I'll help in any way I can. And if it comes right down to the money, you can count on me. I've got it. Thanks, Neff. But I can't borrow from you. I mean, not like the bank. I'll get some men together, Lucas, boy. Let's go. Hey, 
Pete, you and Joe get something to eat and get some rest. All right, Michael, we'll eat over at the hotel. Have Holly scramble some eggs for us. By the way, how long before we ride out again? In an hour. Half hour. Half hour. Lucas. Surely you must have found some trace. We've covered every square inch of territory for 20 miles around. Every house, gully, you name it. It's like the boys vanished into thin air. Whoever's got him, wherever they've got him, it's someplace we don't know about and can't find. Micah. Micah, read this. I found it behind your door. Get rid of the posse. Tell McCain to bring 5,000 cash to the old relay station in Wolf Canyon. Well, no wonder we couldn't find him. That's halfway to Santa Fe. Come alone. Don't try anything. Leave money in sack by door to station house. Turn around and ride out. Your boy will be turned loose when you're gone. On the basis of this, I can get 50 men surround that place and take them. No, Mike, I'll have to go alone. They've gone this far. I can't chance what they'll do. Mark comes first. But where am I going to... Neff. Neff. You always wanted to buy my place, didn't you? Well, now, wait a minute. I'll sell it to you now. No, now, wait, Luke. Five thousand dollars, You Neff. don't want to sell I'm your... I'm upset. I need the money. All right, all right. I'll take a note on your end. Now! Five thousand dollars. Lucas, right. Lucas, let's go to the bank. Come on, John. I'll know what to do. Hurry, John. Three, four, five. That's it, Lucas. Five thousand dollars. Now... You sign this note to Neff, no interest in the ranch's collateral. I'll sign it when I get back. It wouldn't be fair to Neff if something happened to you. Something already happened. I think something was all to ride along, Lucas. We can haul back when you get there. Oh, my God. Now, now, wait. This, I think, Mike is right. Somebody should go along with you, but play it safe. Let me go along with you, Lucas. I'm going I'll alone. stop whenever I'm you going tell alone, me to. Neff, that. Like the note said, that's final. I'll have half the town ready to ride, and we'll get him as soon as Mark's safe. You wait here till I get back, Micah. Good luck. Neff, that was a nice thing you did for Lucas. Uh, can't count on your friends when you need them, then what good are they? Uh, I never much of one for this waiting around. Maybe a drink will help. Can't we have a fire? No fire. Now, come on, eat. No. What do you mean, no? Look, boy, you gotta eat. You ain't eaten nothing since we've been here. I'm not hungry. All right, suit yourself. Only I'm responsible for you. You get sick of something like that, I ain't gonna like it. I wanna go home! Yeah. How much longer are we gonna stay here? Not much longer. Maybe your pa'll be coming for you tomorrow. Pa? Here? Well, that's what I said, didn't I? Uh, are you gonna be here, too? Yeah, until I finish my business with him, then I'll be leaving. What business? Oh, you ask too many questions, kid. Now, come on, now, eat! Sorry, kid, but that's the way it's gotta be. said my pa would be coming. That's right, kid. You won't need that. Yeah. But you... S <laughs> pa! Shut up. Pa! I said shut up! Pa! With this gun, boy, your daddy will be an easy target. Now you get in there and don't you make a sound, you understand me? Get!
What happened? Is Mark all right? All right, I apologize here, but I couldn't let you face things alone. After all, I have an interest in this too, you know. My money... <laughs> Lucas, what's the matter with you? All right, Lucas, let, let's talk this over. Just you and me, we, we can work something out. Lucas? Lucas, I, I, I've got plenty of money. Lucas, name, name your own price. Hey, anything you want, and you'll just forget the whole thing. L Lucas? Lucas? <laughs> Everybody liked him so much. Everybody liked him so much. It just doesn't figure. A man like Neff. Who would have believed it? That's what he was counting on, Micah. Seems like you can't even trust your friends. Oh, now, wait a minute, Mark. You can't judge all your friends by Neff Packer. I don't know. You don't know. Well, take Millie and Micah. They're your friends, right? Right. You trust them, right? Right. Well, take me. I'm your friend, too, right? No, you're my pa. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's say I'm a friendly pa, huh? Ha, 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 ha. 